Hi, this is Laura GB. Welcome to part one of my Power Platform Solutions and Power BI. So here we have a simple solution. It's got a couple of tables. It's got an app and it's got a couple of other things in there. The app it's running is very simple. It's just got an accounts tab there and I can go into an account and my accounts form has got an expenses tab and there we go there's my list of expenses and a big empty gap and off these expenses here I've got a Power BI report so we can see in here the different expenses we've got a very simple chart little table down the bottom here you can see those three rows for amber architecture so we're going to add a Power BI report here your report already has to be published like i've just shown and we go to add existing analytics and i'm going to go for a power bi report it'll bring in the data set as well now i haven't got any already in dataverse so i'm going to go from power bi i'm going to go to choose a workspace and i'm going to go to project management and there we are, there's my one report, my expense report. And I'm going to click add. And after a little while, it will turn you back into solution. It takes a little while, I sped that bit up. You'll see that here we have our expenses data set and our expenses report. Behind the scenes, what it's done in Power BI, let's go and have a look in Power BI. Here's the report we originally had. It's not based off that anymore. It's now based off this report here. So it's added a new workspace called Solutions and then the name of my environment. And there's my report. And it tells you automatically managed by Power Apps. Okay, so you, this is where you'd have to republish a new report to. Be aware of that. But actually what we need to make sure we check in here is that under here we go to settings and let's just make sure our data source credentials are working fine do a refresh just to make sure and let's open the reports it's direct report so it takes a little bit of time to open and there we go we've got our report in there so now let's go back to our solution so we've checked we 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 added it to the solution we check the power bi side the next part to do is to come to the data set here and i click on the three dots now i'm keeping it simple i haven't got parameters or anything in this report i've got an edit and over here it asks you for a display name which you can change but do you want to connect to an existing connection the answer is yes so when i export this solution and i import it somewhere else it'll create a new workspace and a new report that is connected to the new environment so in this video we added our power bi report which also brought in our data set we went and fixed it in the workspace and we tick the box to say it's connected to this environment. Next video, we'll add a dashboard. So press subscribe to get notified when that one gets published. I'm Laura GB. Take care now.